Hi, my name is Tiana Christine and I am giving you this video in order to give you some answers to a burning question. If you're watching this video in real time, we currently are under quarantine and we're not really able to leave our house and be able to purchase items if we wanted to start a yoga practice. So I wanted to give you this video to be able to give you some different options of what you can use in order to still have your yoga practice but maybe not have all the necessary tools that you would normally have if you could go to the store and purchase those items so first let's get started with the basic one that's a yoga mat so if you don't have a yoga mat a yoga mat can look like this or anything like that if you don't have one of these uh, you can allow yourself to be on any type of carpeted non-slip surface if you have wood floors you can put down a nice rug something that has some grip on it like this and you can allow yourself to be on your rug if you want to put down uh, something up for your head you can also do that if you want to put down some type of beach towel or blanket you're welcome to use a beach towel or a blanket as well for a yoga mat now let's go to blocks so I'll tell you this is a regular yoga block it's typically something that's dense this is a foam yoga block if you're looking for say a cork yoga blo block it would look something like this if you do not have one of these and this one is an optional item it's mostly to prop yourself up if you're trying to get into a better posture you're welcome to use some type of book that's gonna be a hardback book that's gonna be dense where you can prop yourself up. Now this is the thickest book that I could find in my home today. So I wanted to still give you some good options for a yoga block. Let's move on to a yoga strap. Now a yoga strap may be used a lot more within a yoga practice, especially if you're wanting to get into postures and give yourself some flexibility. Say you wanna bring your hands out, maybe shoulder width apart, and then bring your arms up overhead. It's a really, really good stretch for your shoulders. You can use a yoga strap. Now if you don't have one of these, here are some alternatives for you. Option number one, is a scarf now i've had this scarf for a very long time it keeps me very warm but you can use this and achieve the same effect so it's a nice scarf you can bring it up overhead same thing still be able to stretch out those shoulders all right that's option number one let's move to option number two and these can be used for your feet or your arms even if you want to put them behind your feet this one's a basic jump rope this is a jump rope I already had in the house. So you can use this as well. Take the jump rope. You can even double it so that it's not as much cord. Take it out in front and still bring it up overhead. Same thing. This is one of the other options for you. Now option number three, if you don't have either of those or you want something else, you can use a belt. A belt will give you that same effect. Take the belt out bring it up overhead. You can adjust this belt as long or as short as you need it. So those are your options. Again, to recap, if you need a yoga mat and you don't have one, feel free to get a nice rug, placing something under your head. If you don't have a nice rug, taking a yoga, uh, a towel or a blanket, a block, if you don't have a nice thick foam block, feel free to use a book. A book is optional. And then of course, if you don't have the yoga strap, feel free to use any of these options, the scarf, the jump rope, or the belt. I hope this helps. I hope this really helps to encourage you to continue your home-based practice. I want you to enjoy yourself during this time. I know that we're dealing with, if you're watching this in real time, a lot of uncertain times. Um, but one thing is for certain, you still can control your breath, your movement, and still be able to keep your personal practice. I think even more than ever, a personal practice and a home-based practice is really important to help us get through these times. So I hope this video helps you. If you found value in it, please like and subscribe to my channel. And I wish you all the best. Until next time, have a good one.